All right, what's up guys? Welcome back to another amazing video. Thank you so much for watching. On this video, I'm gonna be talking about Titan X. So yes, the price has gone down, but here shortly, the price is starting to go a little bit on the upside, like two to 5%, give or take. And I'm not gonna sleep on this. This is a really good opportunity to be able to load up your bags for what's coming. You know, the future is still looking very bright for Titan X. The fact that a lot of people sold for them to be able to get into Drip X, that is the part that gave a lot of opportunity, smart people too, to be able to get in at a very cheap price. At this current price, you can load up some good amount of coins in which if you started a miner, I think like a 200 day give or take miner, you can buy the same amount of coins today for the same price or if not cheaper, uh, probably. So it's great, great opportunity. And who knows how long this can last. There's a small thing I can see happening. Number one. In the next give or take three to four days is going to be very interesting. Drip X is going to have their very first miners claimable and it's most likely going to drop. It's most likely going to tank the price pretty hard because there's so many coins out there. A lot of people are going to try to sell. There's not enough liquidity and it's just going to create panic. It's going to be chaos. I, I know that, right? So I'm ready. I'm prepared for it. I'm trading the coin. I got in pretty cheap. I'm already up like two, three hundred dollars at the current price of Drip X. So What's funny is that a lot of people are paying too much attention about to drip X and that dashboard percentage ROI that they are sleeping on Titan X. They're too worried about the possibility of making hundreds, thousands, millions that Titan X is slowly going to just pop. And if drip X ends up falling in price, people panic, they won't be able to sell. I don't know, not enough liquidity something right worst case scenario it exits exit scams maybe maybe not there's that uh, possibility though but on that day eight of drip x is where we really got to pay attention to because if everything goes down and everything goes downhill really fast people are going to flood back into titan x and the token price is going to see some really good price movement keep that in mind a lot of people sold Titan X to be able to get into Drip X, and then they're going to FOMO back in, especially with Hyper, especially with all the, literally there's so many dApps already coming out, and they are looking very promising. And once they come on through, you watching this video and you being prepared, loading your bags, DCA, you know, starting some miners right now, whatever, right, staking, you are one step ahead of the game. So what I did was I did collect a $1,000 worth of Zen, a batch mint that I did on Cointool, a $1,000 worth of Zen. I sold half, which is about $500 worth, give or take. It was like 400 and some change because of the fees. I went ahead and sold half of my position of that Zen. And now I'm going to get Titan X at the current price of six zeros and a seven seven. Is it a smart way to do it? I don't see why not because I'm using free money to be able to do this. It's literally money I made from Zen, being from other miners. I'm sorry, from the Zen NFTs. And I claimed them and I started new ones. I did abatchments and I'm claiming that one right now for me to be able to get into this pretty much for free. So if it does good, it's great, man. It's free money making me more free money. That's how pretty much crypto should be able to work for you, right? Now, I'm going to continue to do so. Another way I'm going to do it is that on my Zen under Pulse Chain, since I'm making about 17 ish dollars every day, I'm doing half of it into the OG Zen, the Zen Classic. The other half, I'm just accumulating as much as I can, and I'm going to be using it to buy some more Titan X as well. So, my focus right now is loading my bag because. I do see Titan X just pumping really hard from all the big FOMO that everybody's going to do once Drip X does the first claims. Watch it, okay? It's currently day eight on Drip X. On I'm sorry, day three. So you got four days until day eight. 
if you want to trade that token that's fine um if you want to start up some miners that's totally up to you you know this video is just about Titanx, being smart think ahead and pretty much don't let this get away from you because who knows how long these prices can hold a lot of people got in a, an amazing average man i saw some of you t uh, on twitter by the way go follow me it is crypto audit king the link's going to be down below in the description i did see a lot of you guys just start taking screenshots of the token price i think of like six zeros and a six eight eight or something like that so if you got into that average amazing man great i'm really happy for you um i think i loaded up just a little bit like 50 bucks or so like at seven two that's about it but i'm about to buy 500 dollars worth at this price right now of about seven seven ish seven six so I'm going to continue doing so right now, loading up as much as I can. I do see this going crazy in the next few days, so I'm going to be smart with it, okay? Luckily, it's just money I can afford and money that, you know, I can just trade with for free pretty much. And if anything happens, so be it. Uh, I'm already prepared for it. I've been in crypto for long enough to know and just you're just numb to this, right? Um, the token price of DripX is great, but once it drops like 99%, people will panic and FOMO back into Tynex. I see that happening for sure, man. You know, that illusion money, the dashboard money can just throw off people and make them put in more money. I can see that, right? But I can also see another scenario of which the people of Drip X are going to be cashing out some crazy amount of gains. And if they make gains, like how, maybe not how, what it shows, but even a three, four, five X of what they invested, all of that money is going to go into Tynex because a lot of that investment money is the Tynex community. It's some serious money going into there and it will be some serious money coming out if it's profitable, if everything goes right, right? But if it doesn't go right, they're still gonna get scared and FOMO into Tynex. So it's a win-win scenario overall for the token price of Tynex. I'm telling you, the the how everything works around Tynex is great. It's a win-win scenario for it. It's gonna go up no matter what. So whether they build on top of it, copy paste, whatever, it still benefits it. Kind of crazy, man. Very genius way of how this works, of how it was built. So shout out to you and uh, Jake. Man, you're freaking amazing, my boy. Keep up the great work. Very proud of it. I know you're looking out for us on Twitter as well. Pay attention to what Jake says um, on Twitter. Go follow him. Keep up with his tweets and everything. He's pretty much telling you the heads up about what's happening and what could potentially happen in the future. So take notes. If you're new into crypto, you're, you're get ready for a hell of a ride. And that's what I can tell you, especially for the next bull run. And then after that, the bear market. So... Let's see what happens. Let me know what your strategy is down below in the, in the uh, comment section of YouTube. Make sure you click the subscribe button. Make sure you click the like button. It helps the algorithm a lot for more viewers. We bring in a lot more investors and Tynex grows because of it. And let me know, man. I'm really curious to see. I'm not trying to create FUD or negative or anything. I'm just trying to inform you guys about what I see, what I could potentially see the outcomes of. So we'll, it's, it's going to be very interesting. So thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you tomorrow in the next video. Take it easy. I'm out. Peace.